value trades. Welcome to this week's Market Blast Technicals. I'm Brad Alexander, and on behalf of Value Trades, today we will take a look at dollar CAD, dollar yen, the S&P 500, and gold. The desire to buy gold is still with us, but the strength of the U.S. dollar has driven price action down to this lower trend line. The stochastic oscillator is bearish but showing oversold, so we will watch geopolitical events which always affect gold, the strength of the U.S. dollar, and an upturn of our indicators. If you want to swing trade gold, you may use the Gold August contract, or if you want to trade on the shorter term, XAUUSD has spreads as low as 5 cents. Price action finally broke the rising wedge on GBPUSD and, as we predicted, it was a bearish indication. We have to look at the monthly chart to see such high levels on dollar yen, which just touched 133. We haven't seen this for over 20 years, so like many of us, you may want to trade the reversal. Just be careful. Last week we looked at the S&P 500, which, like many markets, has broken this upper trend line. However, price action is now forming this consolidation pattern, which could be a descending triangle if we reach support at around 4075. The stochastic oscillator is clearly bearish right now, so we'll keep an eye on this. Yesterday we looked at dollar CAD and we see the battle between oil and the US dollar. Price action is fighting the downtrend and the stochastic oscillator is looking bullish, but we will wait for it to fall from overbought before we sell dollar CAD. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to Value Trade Signals and the link will be in this video's description below. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel and register on the Value Trades website to get notifications on new content as it happens. That's all for now. Happy trading with Value Trades and we will see you next time. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.